Well, Mets was able to help me in various ways. Firstly, uh, they helped me out with like finance, like making budgets, just preparing myself for like the real world and stuff. And then emotionally, uh, they provided me with like a therapist and really spoke a lot with my social worker. We were really close. Writing has always been a thing I was good at and I think that I liked. So writing helped because I always felt different and I would write about that and it would kind of make me feel more comfortable with being different. The clock on the wall reads a quarter past midnight. Time flies and slowly I realize that I have drifted. Where past scars manifest in ways so bizarre. Dead silent hallways represent the nights I spent awake. Distant whispers terrorize this drifter with promises that I break. Shattered mirrors and stale fears that I can't seem to shake. Bottles swallowed, numbing sorrows bringing hollow tomorrows. And liquid pain provides the brain with a smile that I can borrow. The finish line in this prison drifts in the distance. Can I make it? I see a path. Do I take it? Air. The unseen luxury suddenly seems like it's not a must for me. And the whispers mention a release that promises peace. Just leave. If someone was thinking about coming to a Mets, I would tell them that it's the most caring and supportive place that you could ever go for any kind of help because they really do anything in their power to make sure you're happy.